My name is Fajera. Welcome to back to my YouTube channel. Sorry, I'm like, I'm like really out of it today. Like, okay, let me just give you the tea. So I woke up this morning at like five because somebody crashed their car and the car was on the lawn. Like it was on our lawn. And because I'm nosy, I got up. I was like, what is this? What's going on? And I went and I looked and I stayed up until, you know, eight o'clock, nine o'clock. Actually, I haven't gone back to sleep. And it's currently two. My stomach is hurting. And somebody's car was on my lawn this morning. Cheers. Like, I kid you not, I would love to lay down, but my eyes will not close. The only thing keeping me awake right now is the amount of caffeine flowing through my veins right now. But we're getting ready for a photo shoot. I am going to be working on a piece. I've never done this before, but I have an idea of how to do it. I've never watched a tutorial, didn't do any of that. I just looked at it and was like, I think I can make it. <laughs> so I'm gonna be making a chain like dress type situation. Um, and this is the picture reference that I have right here. This is the concept board that me and the photographer came up with. I'm going to be doing my own like type of vibe like that. It's a little open and I want it to be more closed to keep me more secure up here. But we will get to working on it. Okay, so to start, I've got this. It's basically like rope chain. It's, I'm really hoping this is not like plastic and it is more of a metal. So what I'm thinking I should start with is like the neckline. What it looks like is it rests on the neck. So you put it on and it rests on the neck. I'll just show you. <laughs> yeah, it's giving metal. I'm a little concerned because it's very like, let's just test. That's why I'm concerned. <sighs> we gonna hope for the best. We really are. We're gonna hope for the best. I think it could be fine. Um, everything's fine. I'm like looking at the reference photo over here. It like rests on the neck area. And then it, I'm assuming they kind of just have it draped back here a little bit. Do you catch the, do you, do you see what I'm trying to do? Like, yeah, 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 yeah. Use my pliers to grab the ends that I pulled apart. Again, please forgive me. I literally don't know what I'm saying right now. I probably this will probably be a fever dream tomorrow. Anyway, I use my pliers, grab the ends, and I just pop them into place. This might be wishful thinking, but I'm like looking at this picture and it seems simple enough. And I'm like, this really like I, I feel like I could get this done in like five hours. This is the next size. We're finally getting somewhere. The way that I was trying to do it, it was just not working. And instead of looping it onto this because the chain is too big for this small one. I just kind of looped it around and went back in on itself. Okay, y'all, we're getting somewhere. You see? This is what we're working with right now. Okay. We kind of want to start bringing this down and around and start creating the bra shape. So I've got these. They're also nickel-free. I'm allergic to nickel. They're, cons they're called split rings. I just attached this. And now I'm going to just open this, this up and attach it to this. So here again, we're going to go ahead and open this link up and attach it right here and close it. Y'all see what I see? Looping it through here. I'm gonna open up. Okay, so we got one on. Praise him, praise God. With that. I hope that you guys are like getting the gist of what I'm doing. So I'm just gonna keep going until I at least get this side done and then I'll come back when this side is complete. So we've gotten this far and I tightened the neckline a little bit. I'm still gonna adjust this later once the piece is complete. Um, I have one boob almost done. 
And with leftover chain material, just so that I'm not being wasteful, I am taking five of these little chains. I'm taking it, opening it like that. And then um, one, two, three, five, placing them five apart. And the reason for that is because with the smaller ones, I'm gonna put them at the third point. Okay, just to give it some, a little something extra. But this is what we have so far and I'm just gonna keep going and then you'll see when this is completely done. So I got one side done and this is what it's looking like. I added the, the small ones, the small chains in between the larger chunkier ones. So this side is done. Okay, y'all. So this is what we have so far. And I'm really liking it. This is the right side. And this is the left side. Okay, everyone. Hi, welcome back. Um, this is the next day and we're gonna work on the skirt part. I did go back to Michael's. They're called lobster clasps. I look like this. So I got some lobster clasps because I want to be able to take this off with ease. sides done this is what they look like I think they look pretty asymmetrical um, but I'm also one to love the imperfections of the things that I make I think that makes it that much more beautiful I have the two sides done and now I'm gonna do something really pretty in the middle so this is the finished look this is the chain skirt that I created um, this is what it looks like from the back with the claw clip so it's easy to take off now and then I'm gonna show you guys what it looks like with the top part. This is the finished look. Um, I can't show you the outfit because it's a little revealing, you know what I mean? But we have the top and I'm pretty proud of the way it, all of this turned out. And we have the bottoms. And then this is the back. So it took me about six, six hours roughly. And my hands are sore, but baby. <laughs> the next thing I'm gonna work on is the crown part. I forgot to film this part, but I got all my charms and my sticks for my headpiece and my flowers and I spray painted them gold and now I'm just waiting for them to dry. Um, these are the spray painted pieces and I have the gold spray painted charms as well. I got some flowers from Michael's I believe and they were on sale. This headband that I got from the dollar store. So this is the flower crown part. As you can see, I ran out of material, but since this is gonna be like on the side of my head, I don't really think it's that big of a deal.
This is what it's looking like so far. Hi, so I forgot to film a proper outro, but if you guys like this video, please give it a like and a comment down below. I have pictures on my Instagram. The photo shoot came through. If you want to see some behind the scenes of the photo shoot, it's also on my Instagram and also on my TikTok, which I'll link down below. But I'll see you guys in the next one. Bye.